Few area Kiambu County are set to benefit from the top of the art sewer line whose construction is ongoing. Speaking during the inspection of the project, Water CS Cecily Karaoke observed that the project will benefit more than 80,000 residents and its environs. <laughs> Akuna kusukuma muda kwa vile wakaji wa hapa ni mradi utawasaidia kivikubwa ikiwapo population wale watu wanaishi kufanya Nairobi na kwengine maeneo karibu hapa wanaishi hapa. Kwa hivyo ni mradi uko na umuhimu, umuhimu sana kimaendeleo. Ni mradi pia utasaidia biashara kuenea kwa hili kwa hii eneo ya kikuyu. Vile vile, kikuyu vile tunaelewa, kuna institutions ambazo ni muhimu sana za zarekali. Ikiwapo mashule, Alliance Boys Girls, ikiwapo Thogoto, ikiwapo University ya Nairobi, na ikiwapo pia slaughterhouses ambao pia water watakuja kusaidika na county. Principal Secretary, Ministry of Water, Sanitation and Irrigation, Joseph Irungu, assured that the second phase of the project is set to be complete ahead of the stipulated time. We are looking to the future of this, uh, this job because uh, we have an added date with a contractor which is, uh, which is June 2022 and we are already in talks with the contractor to have him hasten the works to bring the works uh, nearer, uh, completion nearer to maybe by two months or so, because uh, everything is now set. We have the requisite resources. We have the, the goodwill of the people. They have allowed us to get into the RAD. And uh, therefore, we think this project can be finished uh, uh, maybe two or three months ahead of the scheduled June 2022. The second phase is likely to take about uh, two billion Kenya shillings. And we are already on course. We have uh, requisition for that money. The National uh, Rad Commission is actually ad undertaking that, that process. Gatondo North member of Parliament, Wanjiko Kibe, commended the ongoing project. We are going to have the optic uh, in the design to ensure even once the project is complete, then we have some water for our people, especially who those who are downstream. And I want to believe that is going to happen. Uh, we are also very happy because there is a consideration through the office of the PS for an irrigation project again to support our people. The project will cost approximately 23.6 billion shillings and is expected to serve an additional 850,000 people in Ruiru, Juja and parts of Nairobi. Lynette Gidua, TV47.